Hi guys, I'm Andy. Welcome back to Scottish Dream Productions, another video. Today I'm going to tell you how stupid I've been with planning this exhibition layout. I could have cost myself hundreds if not tens of thousands of pounds of extra work when I didn't really need to. The extra baseboards, the track, trying to create a gigantic loop when I could have just created an end-to-end -end layout of what I've already got. I figured this out a couple of days ago when looking at the plans I've made for the exhibition layout. It's going to be gigantic. It will probably fill my entire sitting room. Um, and I calculated the cost. Because I'll need to get extra baseboards built. It would cost me probably another further seven to eight hundred pounds just to get those extra baseboards built to a good standard where they won't, you know, break within the first month. And then I realized I don't need to get any extra baseboards. I just need to be smart about how I'm going to reposition them to make an end-to-end -end exhibition layout. And I thought, why did not... How could it be so stupid? Why didn't I think of that in the first place? So I'm going to show you what the plan was going to be. So this is just a rough sketch of what I currently have. I have three small baseboards, a medium, a triangle, and a large. So here, so about there, would have been the scenery cutoff and the trains would have gone round to the fiddle yard. Now my idea was to have an extra one of these baseboards, no sorry, an extra one, two, three, four, about five or six more of these baseboards built to make the fiddle yard and a bit of extra scenery. That would have cost me about 800 quid. So that is a big no. What I should have done in the first place is just reorganize all the baseboards to make an end-to-end -end layout. So what's going to happen is these two are going to get turned around this way. So it's the one that has the weird little cutout in it. That's going to be a little embankment or something. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn that that way. So I'm going to have the large baseboard, the medium one, and then I'm going to have a small one there. Sorry if you can hear Caleb, he's having a bit of a play around. Do you want to say hello? Caleb? Hey, are you trying to photobomb my video mister? Are you? Bless you. Okay, so after about 20 different sketches, I'm sorry guys, I'm really tired. This is what I originally had. I had the baseboard that had the cut to the back scene over there. And this was one that also had the cut for like the hole in between the two baseboards. So these two are always going to be together. Then I've got the second medium. So I've got one large, two mediums, three small and one triangle. It was only when I moved them about on Skidio I figured out that I could do this. So by moving this one round the back of the large one I have a baseboard for fiddle yard of track. The two will always stay the same and then the triangle and three will make the scenery here. And just by doing that, I've probably saved myself about a grand's worth of baseboards, five grand's worth of track and points and wiring. I don't know why it took me this long to figure it out. So this is going to be the final baseboard design. The track design is still being uh, figured out. Um, it's also still going to have a heritage railway and a main line. That's the thing I've always wanted to do. I got the idea mainly from uh, Stras Bay Railway because they have a station connecting with the mainline station and I just think it's a brilliant idea. So, the baseboard has been planned. What's happening next, I don't know guys, but for now, this is what's going to happen. Pitch in, some, pitch in some ideas in the comments, as always. I will read, I will reply, I will love you all for doing that. Thank you guys so much for being patient with me and... The <clears throat> Sorry, and the really slow upload schedule. 
I'm a stay-at-home dad now. Uh, don't work anymore. You can probably hear Caleb rattling in the background under his play gym. A lot to do. Not a lot of time to do it. But thank you so much for being patient. I hope this is um, exciting for you. Uh, and we'll hopefully see progress to come. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like to leave a good... <laughs> oh God. I am very tired, guys. I do apologize. Here we go again. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, leave a like and a good comment. If you didn't like it, leave a dislike and a bad comment. And as always, I will see you in the next video. And see you later. Bye for now. Calm forth, engine shed. Now with the home for swine scrubs. Reduction, I go to let me do. Lindsay and Lord Nelson. Today, yesterday. And the black fight and the naive guy. And Bob is there galore. A line beyond the Frenchman was many, many more. Good God, I need a haircut.